So ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back once again to the greatest watch market update show in the world. Unbelievable, but true, but we do. You know, me and Kino always try to bring you what's really happening out there in the Muppet Boiler Room secondary great watch market. Unbelievable, but true, but we do. Unbelievable. And today we have an unbelievable watch market update lined up for you. Unbelievable watch collectors out there. Unbelievable, but true, unbelievable. And ladies and gentlemen, we also want to share, as you know, Kino has prepared for you watch collectors an unbelievable Facebook watch group. Unbelievable. And if you want to join this private watch group, you may do so. As you can see, you're going to have to go to my page, which my name is Juan Nieves. And then you're going to scroll down to where about, and you're going to find the watch group Opus in Time Watches. And you may join that group if you would like to. It's there. It's there for you guys to join it. You know, we want real, honest people joining our watch group. You know, we don't want no hoodwinks, no hucksters, and no flim flammers in our watch group. But it's there, okay? So if you want to join the Opus in Time Watches watch group, it is there for you guys to get involved in that uh, watch group, okay? There it is. You can see uh, the pictures of myself, my page, and, you know, follow a lot of them. Anyway, guys, so we have prepared for you guys an unbelievable watch market update today for you guys. Unbelievable. It's going to knock your socks off that the prices that are happening out there, you're not going to believe it. But before we get into all that good stuff, let's go into my magical intro. So ladies and gentlemen, I'm back and let's just dive into the first watch market update watch. Our first watch is a watch that a lot of you out there are very, very much excited about and, and willing to pay whatever these Muppet Boiler Room secondary great watch market channels and dealers tell you to. But we're going to talk about a watch. It's a Rolex white gold GMT. And unbelievable, you're not gonna believe this watch. This watch is a white gold GMT Pepsi. You know, the reference number of this beautiful Rolex, it is the 116719. This watch has a retail price of $36,750. This watch at the uh, Corona era, it had a price of over $55,000. That's right, over $55,000. We're talking about an unbelievable looking watch. This watch is also discontinued. You know, discontinued like the one they were telling you last year, you know, that Rolex GMT Pepsi with the Jubilee band, you know? You know, with the red and blue bezel. Unbelievable, you know? Unbelievable, with the black dial. And you, all of you were going crazy and you were willing to pay 25, 26, 27, 23, 24, 20, whatever it is, you know? I'm gonna talk to you about this watch, the 116719 Rolex GMT White Gold. This is a white gold Pepsi. Discontinue. And I can tell you this watch was worth 36,000, the retail price, $36,750. And it was over 55, like I told you. And I'm going to have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, if you're thinking of buying that stainless steel Jubilee band, Pepsi, take a look-see. Take a look-see. I'm not telling you to buy it. Take a look-see at this white gold, you know, heavy white gold. Beautiful looking 116719 GMT. You know, one of the first ones that came out with the Oyster bracelet. And I'm going to have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, I mean, you do whatever you want, but don't pay. And I mean, don't pay. This is to me a bargain price. I'm going to be kind when I say this price. I've been following this watch for, for the last year and a half. And I'm going to have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, take a look at this watch before buying a stainless steel Jubilee Pepsi. Take a look at this Rolex GMT White Gold Oyster Bracelet. And 
don't pay, and I mean don't pay more than $25,000 and it is dropping. I just wanna tell you, I have a couple of friends of mine which are watch dealers and they have purchased that watch. One was full set for $23,000 and the other one was not full set for $21,500. We're talking about white gold and we're talking about used slider condition material watches in this channel. We're talking about used slider condition material watches. This unbelievable GMT Pepsi, white gold with an oyster bracelet, I'm telling you, take a look at it and don't pay more than $25,000, okay? Our next watch is a Rolex Titanium. I've been talking to you about this watch. I've been monitoring this watch for the last month and a half. And I have seen the way this watch has declined. We're talking about a titanium Yacht Master black dial, black ceramic bezel. Unbelievable looking time machine, as you can see. Unbelievable. This Yacht Master 42 millimeter. Unbelievable, like I said, with a black dial, black ceramic bezel. The reference number that watch is the 226627. It has a retail price of $14,050. And at one moment when this first watch was released, it was over, over $60,000. That's right, over $60,000. You heard the retail price, $14,050, and it was over $60,000. And I've been telling you for the last uh, month, you know, don't pay 33, don't pay 32, don't pay, you know, 30. And I'm gonna have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, I mean, you do whatever you want with your money. I understand a lot of you out there are loaded. I understand that. But me and Kino here to tell you what we believe, we think you guys should pay for that watch. And we're gonna have to tell you, don't pay for that beautiful Rolex Titanium Yacht Master. Don't pay more than $28,000 and dropping, okay? I mean, you do whatever you want. Unbelievable, but true. Our next watch is the Rolex GMT White Gold Meteorite Dial. Unbelievable, you know, another Pepsi, you know? This watch at one moment was over $85,000. Unbelievable, unbelievable looking time machine as you can see in the picture, unbelievable. You know, the retail price of that watch is $40,600, that's right. And I can tell you it was over, over $80,000 at one moment. We're talking about a 40 millimeter watch, unbelievable looking time machine, unbelievable. The reference number that watch is the 126719BLRO, unbelievable. And I'm gonna have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, I mean, you do whatever you want. You do whatever you want, but don't pay for that Rolex GMT, white gold, meteorite dial, Pepsi as well. Don't pay more than $42,000 and, okay? Watch market is dead. Don't let these flim flammers keep on fooling you. The watch market is dead. I know what I'm telling you, the watch market is dead. I'm not gonna use no more backyard pool, you know, floating, none of that stuff. I mean, stop being lollipop suckers. Don't be no more slaves to these flim flammers. Don't keep on maintaining their lifestyle, their go fast red car, their sushi, their steak dinner, you know? You understand? You gotta stop maintaining these people. You know, these people have been flim flamming you for too long until sweet kid Kino came along. Kino was right here watching me, you know, do this program because he is the owner of this channel. He directs me how to do things. Unbelievable. But sweet kid Kino right here, he's unbelievable. Until me and him came around, it was over. So you cannot continue letting these cockroaches, these monkeys. These guys were a bunch of monkeys, you know? A bunch of monkeys, a bunch of momos. You know what a momo is? You don't know what a momo is? Google it, and you'll find out what a momo is. You understand me? Stop being tomato cans, right? The watch market is dead. Our next watch is the Rolex, Rose Gold Daytona. 
unbelievable with a black dial. This Rolex Daytona with the rose gold with a black dial is an unbelievable combination. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. And let me explain to you something about this watch. This watch had one moment. Back in the time, back in the day, you know, in the 2000s, you know, back in the in the early 2000s, this watch was unbelievable. People were going bananas for this watch. They really wanted it. You know, the reference number of this beautiful looking Rolex Daytona Rose Gold with a black dial is the 116505. This is a 40 millimeter. This example was from 2008. We're talking about use slider condition material watches in this channel, in this channel. Unbelievable, but true, unbelievable. And this watch went all the way up, you know, like the song, all the way up. At one moment, over $50,000, that's right. Over $50,000. And I'm gonna have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, don't pay more for this beautiful, Rolex Daytona Rose Gold with a black dial. I mean, this is fully Rose Gold. Unbelievable, this Daytona. I mean, I think it's an unbelievable combination. And I'm gonna have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, don't pay more than $34,000 and you know what it is. Unbelievable, unbelievable. The watch market is dead. Unbelievable. Our next watch is the Rolex. Stainless steel, Darth Vader. <gasps> the Star Wars. <sighs> this Darth Vader with a black bow and black ceramic bezel at one moment was over, over $40,000. Unbelievable, you know? Unbelievable, as you can see the, the picture of this watch. Unbelievable looking time machine. The reference number that watch is the 116500LN. It has a 40 millimeter case. Has a retail price of $14,800. And like I told you, it was at one moment over $40,000. And ladies and gentlemen, we're talking about used slider condition material watches in this channel. We're talking about a 2016, 17, 18 model. And I'm gonna have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, don't pay more, and I mean don't pay more for that beautiful Darth Vader. Don't pay more than $20,000 and dropping. Unbelievable. The watch market is dead. You guys got to stop being slaves to these Muppet Boiler Room secondary gray watch market channels. The watch market is dead. No matter what they keep on telling you, the watch market is dead. Eso no correcto, Gino que el negocio de los relojes está muerto. Dime nada más con la cabeza, sí, no importa. Estos son unos gilipollas, ellos no entienden todavía. Todavía están con la mente, con ácido, en la chola. Increíble. Kino Tomillas, unbelievable. Don't pay more than $20,000 for that Darth Vader. I mean, you do whatever you want, okay? Unbelievable. Our next watch is an unbelievable brand new watch. This watch just came out in April, you know, in April of 2024. We're talking about the Bruce Wayne, you know, Bruce Wayne from Batman. This is a Rolex GMT with a black and gray ceramic bezel black dial with a green, I don't know, second hand, some kind of hand is green in that watch, unbelievable. Jubilee bracelet, unbelievable looking watch, unbelievable looking watch. The reference number that watch is the 126710 GRNR. It has a retail price of $10,900. And when it was first released a couple of months ago or a month ago, it was over $35,000, that's right, over $35,000. And I'm gonna have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, I mean, you do whatever you want with your money. Like I'm telling you, you've been flim flam for too long, you know? You, you've been mesmerized by these flim flammers, by these hoodwinks, by these hucksters for too long. So it's almost impossible for you to believe 
that the prices are dropping so quickly. And I'm gonna have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, don't pay more for that beautiful Bruce Wayne GMT stainless steel with a Jubilee band with a black and gray ceramic bezel, black dial. Don't pay more. I mean, you do whatever you want, but don't pay more than $21,000. And it is, okay, by the week. All right? You know, ladies and gentlemen, I have a subscriber that he went all the way to Monte Carlo. He went all the way to the French Riviera. And this is an unbelievable subscriber. Unbelievable. So he went over there and uh, he went to the uh, to the Formula One Grand Prix of Monte Carlo and he got me this cup. Unbelievable, you know, got me this cup. This is unbelievable and a special gift. You know, these people are incredible. I don't know how they found those seats because those seats are unbelievable but expensive. Imagine he got me this this uh, hat that cost like a hundred dollars. A hundred dollars, unbelievable. You know, and we're trying to make hats for from uh, from Opus and Time that the watch market is dead, and we're gonna charge like I don't know thirty dollars, thirty nine dollars. I don't know whatever Kino says, but this hat, this is unbelievable. Look at that, the Monaco Grand Prix history, unbelievable. So he got me this, uh, you know, and uh, the Automobile Club of, uh, of Monte Carlo, Monaco, unbelievable. He got me that, so this is unbelievable. So he got me the cup and all these goodies, and he even got me one of these, uh, you know, uh, look at that. Uh, unbelievable, the, the racetrack, unbelievable. So he got me all this stuff, you know, these people, are, these rich people are unbelievable. I don't know how they do it, but they have all this money because he he was telling me that the, the seats uh, cost like around three thousand dollars unbelievable three thousand dollars i don't know how much this cup costs but i'm sure it must have cost like coming from monaco it must have cost like 50 bucks i don't know anyway so he got me that so you know who you are thank you very much for those beautiful special gifts and you know memories from the grand prix of monte carlo unbelievable thank you very much again unbelievable subscribe Unbelievable. I think I helped them out with some watches and prices and you know, send me that, you know. Unbelievable. Our next watch is the Rolex Submariner two-tone bluesy. The 40 millimeter. Unbelievable looking time machine, this bluesy. Unbelievable. This one of the most beautiful blue dials in the Rolex catalog lineup. You know, the bluesy, the old two-tone bluesy. Todos los cubanos de Miami con la cadena de perro con un submarino. <laughs> unbelievable. You don't, you don't understand what I said? Google it. You know, unbelievable. Google it. Unbelievable. And this watch is an unbelievable looking time machine. As you can see the, in the picture, unbelievable looking time machine. This watch has a retail price of $15,300. And at one moment, you know, in the Corona era, it was over, over $25,000. The reference number that watch is the 116613LB 40 millimeter. That's right. That's right. And ladies and gentlemen, we're talking about use slider condition material watches in this channel. Use. We're talking about an example of 2015, you know. 2016, yeah, 17, you know, those years, use. And I'm gonna have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, I mean, you do whatever you want with your money. You do whatever you want, but don't pay for that beautiful Rolex bluesy with that beautiful blue dial. Don't pay more than $11,500 and dropping. Unbelievable, but true, unbelievable. I mean, the watch market is dead. It's, you know, it's there. It's, you know, I, I'm going to tell you, you know, it's, 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 it's getting real close already. It's getting real close from, you know, heading bottom, you know, you know, like bottom fishing, you know, it's almost there already, ladies and gentlemen. It's almost there. Be patient. It's almost there already. Okay. Be patient, uh, Muppet Boiler Room Secondary Great Watch Market Channels. It is almost there. Not there quite. But it's almost there. How long before it hits bottom? Mm, the only one that knows that is Kino, and he doesn't want to tell me. That Kino's unbelievable, you know, unbelievable. 
Our next watch is a Patek Philippe. Rose gold, $59.80 with a leather strap. Unbelievable. This is an unbelievable looking time machine. This paddock, $59.80 with the leather strap is an unbelievable combo. And I really mean that. This is, you know, rose gold is, you know, rose gold is unbelievable. You know, it's, it's unbelievable that rose gold, you know, it's unbelievable. And with the leather strap, with that cognac leather strap, wow. It is just smoking. It'll blow your socks off, you know? Unbelievable looking time machine. And this watch, you know, this watch has a retail price of $76,880. And it was over at one moment, over $150,000. That's right. We're talking about a 40.5 millimeter. That's right. And I'm going to have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, this watch was discontinued and people were going crazy, you know, with the discontinued. You know, all of you out there are bananas with that discontinued word. You know, you hear discontinued, you think the watch is going to go to a million dollars. Well, I got news for you. Watch mark is dead. It's dead. And I'm going to have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, don't pay for this beautiful paddock, 5980 rose gold, with a leather cognac color strap don't pay more i mean you do whatever you want with your money i understand you guys are loaded and you like to give money away to maintain these muppets boiler room secondary great watch market channels and dealers lifestyle i understand that you want them to keep on living that lifestyle with your money but i'm gonna have to tell you ladies and gentlemen don't pay more and i mean don't pay more for that beautiful 5980 paddock rose gold don't pay more <laughs> Unbelievable when I tell you this. Don't pay more than $93,000 and it, it is dropping. Unbelievable. It is dropping. I mean, you're not going to believe this bit. It is dropping. Our next watch is a Richard Mill. Richard Mill, Felipe Massa. Unbelievable. The RM011, RM011. Unbelievable. Rolls go with titanium. Unbelievable looking watch. I'm just going to tell you what this watch at one moment it was at in the Corona era. It was over, over, over $400,000. Unbelievable looking time machine. Unbelievable. To all of you out there that like Richard Mill watches, this is an unbelievable looking watch. This Felipe Massa, unbelievable. You know, this FM is an unbelievable looking watch. And I, like I tell you, it's over $400,000. And I'm going to have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, I mean, you do whatever you want, but don't pay more for that beautiful Richard Mill, Felipe Massa, Rose Gone, Titanium, RM011. Don't pay more than $178,000. And unbelievable. Our next watch is the Vacheron Constantin, the 4500V, Rose Gold. Like I have always said, and I'll keep on saying it, you know, one of the the most important brands out there, you know, Bacheron Constantin, they make one of the most beautiful blue dials in the watch business. They really do. In particular, on this beautiful 4500V Rose Gold. Rose Gold with a blue dial, magical. This watch is an unbelievable example of a watch. Elegant, classy, unbelievable. Unbelievable, as you can see in the picture. Unbelievable looking watch. You know, this watch has a retail price of $60,500. And in the Corona era, it was all the way up, like the, like the song, all the way up, all the way up of $125,000. That's right. We're talking about you slighted condition material watches in this channel. Unbelievable, but true. Unbelievable. And I'm going to have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, don't pay for that Bacheron Constantin 4500V Rose Gold 41 millimeter with a retail price of $60,500. And at one moment, once upon a time, it was worth over $125,000. I'm going to have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, don't pay more than $48,000. And it is dropping. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Our next watch is the Adamas Piquet Royal Oak. Stainless steel chronograph. Unbelievable looking time machine. 
The reference number of that watch is the 26331. Unbelievable, as you can see in the picture. Unbelievable looking watch. 41 millimeter. Has a retail price of $33,900. And it was over, over in that Corona era, you know, when you guys were going nuts and giving your money away, giving away your SBA loans to these uh, hucksters and hoodwink. You know, you guys were giving away your PPPP loans to these uh, these uh, cockroaches and monkeys. You know, you were just giving it away to them. You know, you didn't care. You know, let me give my PPP money away to these uh, flim flammers. I love them, you know, I, I, I idolize them. Let me give it to them, you know, my SBA, my government grants, my stimulus checks, unemployment checks. You just gave it all away. Unbelievable. This watch at one moment was over, over $70,000 over $70,000, unbelievable. Young kids jumping up and down with the Louis Vuitton Nike sneakers and, and the hoodies, you know, and the red gold fast car and the diamond chains, just giving money away, you know, maintaining these uh, hucksters love lifestyle, you know, just maintaining their lifestyle, unbelievable but true. I'm gonna have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, don't pay for this beautiful Audemars Piquet Royal Old Chronograph. 41 millimeter stainless steel. What a beautiful looking time machine. Don't pay. I mean, you do whatever you want. I can tell you, retail price of that watch is $33,900, over $60,000. And I'm going to have to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, don't pay more. And I mean, don't pay more than $33,000 and dropping. Well, ladies and gentlemen, there's your watch market update for this week. I hope you enjoyed it. You know, we don't want to hear me and Kino have come to the conclusion that we don't want to scare you anymore with the big drops. You know, and the watch market is dead in the backyard pool and floating face down like this. You know, the watch market is dropping faster than Bill Clinton's pants in an Arkansas farmhouse. You know, we don't want to keep on scaring you, but it's there, you know, it's, it's, it's there already, you know. It's at two and a half already, you know, it's at two and a half. You know, it's, it's getting there, it's getting there. The watch market is really, really, really and dire straight, you know, it's, it's unbelievable. Well, guys, I really hope you enjoy what I had to say about the watch market update this week. Don't forget to subscribe to this magical, magical channel. And like me and Kino say every week, take care and brush your hair. El Castillo San Felipe.